Good evening. Tonight I feel proud to share my story with so many committed environmental supporter. My river is in crisis. The cities upstream and downstream raised to increase the economic growth by emptying natural resources, ignoring the impact to the river and to the people, and damaging the life of the futures of next generation. For my family, the river is, was always center of our life. We went there in the morning and the evening for watch, for watch, for watch. <laughs> yeah, for watch. <laughs> my grandmother sold uh, the fish she catch from the river at the market. And today, the pollution has made this way of life impossible. We have to remember that the future generation have the right to healthy river and clean water. Our action today have consequences for the life of our grandchildren. I'm sure that no one here want our grandchildren to remember us as selfish generation because we only like to take, take and take without giving back. My government has not protected our river. We must keep the river healthy for ourselves. We, be, we will be like the beast that always watch and sting the government. Yes. To push them to fulfill their responsibility. We will also work to organize a grassroots movement and invest in the future generation with environmental education. I believe that children have the power to make difference. So let's work for their participation in this hard struggle to conserve our planet. I thank to Goldman Prize this great honor. I also thank the Brantas Warrior, my friend at the Cotton, and the community near leaving the river. It's hard work, but to be continued. <laughs> I also thanks to my partner, WWF US, Asoka Foundation, Environmental Leadership Program, UC Berkeley, for their support. Finally, thanks to my number one supporter, my wife, Darius Giorini. <laughs> and my family who understand when I come home late. <laughs> I could not face this fight without them. Thank you.